Some young downhill racers from across central Pennsylvania put their driving skills to the test today. Eyewitness News reporter Joe Garrison takes us to the annual Soapbox Derby in Williamsport. Young racers hop in and steer their soapbox derby cars down Market Street in Williamsport. They try to keep them straight, gravity does the rest. Drivers say there's a trick to gaining a little more speed down the hill. So you sit really far back in the car and you try to keep your back against the back of the car and you put your head down all the way to the front and as close to the ground you can get. And while his father, Barry Loner, loves to see Braden go fast, it's safety first out on the hill. Drivers wear helmets and they are trained to use steering and brakes to stay in their lane and avoid wiping out. It's very nerve wracking because it's happened to other people, and when you see it happen, it's like, oh boy, I hope that doesn't happen to us. There is some history here in Williamsport. The event goes back quite a few years before World War II. It sure did. Williamsport initially had derby racing from 1941 to 1954. And then it disappeared for 56 years, and we brought it back in 2010. More than 60 racers in the stock and super stock divisions compete to see who can cross the finish line first. No instant replays are needed. Winners are determined electronically. And the fun extends beyond race day. The cars arrive as kits that the drivers and their friends and family put together. Simone Gare is careful to make sure everything is in working order on a car she knows front to back. It's fun. You get to really feel like you're in charge of your car and how you have ownership of it. Some families say they really enjoy the competition among friends. You get to see them at the construction clinic and then hang out with them pretty much the whole day here out on the hill and you get to meet people that I haven't seen for a while and uh, get to renew some friendships. In Williamsport, Joe Garrison, Eyewitness News. Two winners will move on to compete next month at the next level in the National Soapbox Derby in Akron, Ohio. Race organizers say Lucas McCacken of Muncie won the stock division and Sarah Stugart of Williamsport won the super stock division.